Hey there everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com and we are back with the uh, Asus E-Pad Transformer. We're about to do something really cool with it, watch this. So I'm just gonna, you know, hi. I'm typing on the Asus E-Pad Transformer. No hands, no fingers, nothing on the keyboard, nothing on the screen, it's magic! Actually no, it's uh, USB ports in the uh, keyboard dock. So here's how they work, literally, I've got a, an old keyboard laying around and I've got my venerable old Logitech red mouse thing. I've used this for years. I still have it, still use it every day, love it. Plug it in, works just fine. How about that? We're in the uh, Polaris uh, word processing app and plug in a mouse and it's just like using the trackpad on the uh, keyboard dock itself only, you know, it's a handheld mouse. I like them better. I don't like trackpads much. So we showed you the mouse before. Here's another look at it. Uh, you know, it's a pointing device. Works like you think a mouse should work. Let's open up the browser real quick. I keep double clicking. You don't need to uh, double click on this. But here is the uh, the browser, and here's Android Central. And again, you just point the mouse where you want to go, and it takes you there. So you can scroll just fine. Uh, the scroll wheel on my mouse actually works. So you have a little uh, page up, page down buttons. Those will also take you up and down. Very, very cool. Uh, remember, if you left click, it will select something. If you right click, it goes back. So the last thing we had open is the uh, Asus page there. Uh, let's check out something else as long as we're here. So uh, when you're on, I keep calling this the desktop when I'm using it in laptop mode, but when you're on the home screens to swipe between them on the uh, trackpad, you do multi-touch. So you do two fingers, go left, go right. If you have a mouse plugged in, you just click and drag. I'm gonna click and drag and go through the home screens. Same thing for moving things around, you just click and move it. Very, very cool. It actually lends itself very well to that. Uh, let's open up Google Earth and see how it behaves. So let's see, we've already had it open. See, I can double click and go back to True North or thereabouts, maybe. Not quite, let's try that again. Where's my mouse? Here it is. There we are, back at North. Uh, the scroll wheel doesn't work for zooming in here, but double click and that will zoom in quite nicely. So there's New York City and the tri-state area. Um, anything else we want to see? Books. You can read books this way too if you want. Here's Alice in Wonderland already on here. Uh, same thing you do with the trackpad. If you want to go left and right, multi-touch left and right, you just drag left, right. Very smooth, very nicely done, very cool. Um, anything else you want to do with the mouse and keyboard that you can't do? Um, it, you know, it's, it's pretty normal. You want to type, start typing. Great for uh, email. So again, it's getting closer and closer to being able to uh, replace a laptop, which is very cool. I like that a lot. So there you go. A very quick look at a keyboard and mouse support on the Asus E-Pad Transformer. See ya.